Hi everyone, welcome to the session. In this session, I am going to discussing about uh, some important problems related to averages. Let's see the first question in this session. See here, in an entrance examination, Seema scored 56 percentage marks and uh, Nithya scored 92 percentage marks. Meena scored 634 marks. The maximum marks of the examination are 875. Total maximum marks are 875. Now, according to the first statement, SEMA scored 56 percentage. What is 56 percentage of this value? This is the marks scored by SEMA. And next, after that, Nithya. Total marks are 875. Out of that, Nithya scored 92 percentage. This is the total marks scored by Nithya. And next, after that, Meena. Meena score directly that value is given, which is uh, 634. First, we will calculate this value so that you will get the answer easily. 25, 4, sir, and next 25, 3, 75, 12, and next 25, 5, sir. Now, here it is 4, one time, and next uh, 14. Now, you can uh, multiply these two, 35 into 14, 35 into 10, 350, 35 into 10, 350, and 35 into 4 which is equal to 140. So if you add these two, what you will get? 490. So this value is equal to 490. Next, after that, here you can, uh, here also 25 four, sir, 25 35. And next, uh, 4 23s. 23 into 35, that you need to calculate. 25 into 30, uh, 25 in, uh, 35 into 20, that is equal to 700. Still, uh, 35, 3, sir. 35, 3, sir, that is 105, which is equal to 805. So, this value is equal to 805. And MENA scored 634. MENA scored 634. That is the given information. Now, the question, what he is asking exactly is, what are the average marks scored by all three girls together? Average of all three girls together. Average is equal to what? Sum of all three girls divided by number of persons. That is 3. Now, here the values are 490 plus 805 plus 634 divided by 3, which is equal to, here it is units place 9, and next uh, 3 plus 9, 12, and next uh, 5, 5 plus 8, 13, 13 plus uh, 6, uh, 19 by 3, which is equal to, here it is uh, 6 times, and next uh, 4 times, and next 3 times, uh, 643. That is the required average. Average mark scored by all 3 girls together, which is equal to 643. Option D is the uh, right answer for this question. Let's move on to the next question. See here. This is very important. Little bit of calculation part is involved. In an organization, the average salary of 25 employees, which is given as 12,000. Total 25 employees are there. And 25 employees average is given as 12,000. If the average salary of 15 employees is increased by 15 percentage, here, the salary of uh, 15 persons increased by 15 percentage. First of all, what is the increment? What is the increment value? Take that value. Here, the increment value is 15 percentage. 15 percentage. What is 15 percentage of total salary average is uh, 12,000? Here, these two values will be cancelled, which is equal to increment for 15 members. 15 members increment is equal to 15 into 12, 180, 180 and one more zero which is equal to 1800. And uh, here the increment is 1800 and the average salary initially that is 12,000. Therefore, for these uh, 15 members, 15 members salary is equal to increment is 1800 plus average salary 12,000 which is equal to 13,800. And next, 10 remaining 10 members increment is equal to 10 percentage. 
ten percentage of total twelve thousand. That value is very simple and uh, which is equal to twelve hundred. Therefore, those ten members salary is equal to increment is twelve hundred plus initial salary twelve thousand, which is equal to thirteen thousand two hundred. Now we will calculate the new average after increment. New average after increment is equal to here first 15 members uh, average value 13,800. Therefore sum is equal to 15 into 13800 plus and next 10 members average 13200. Therefore sum is equal to 10 into 13200. Now, I want the average of all 25 members. This is the new average of uh, 25 members. So, new average of 25 members is equal to sum of 15 members plus uh, sum of remaining 10 members divided by total 25 members, which is equal to. Now, you can calculate these two. 138 into 15. Here, two zeros are there. Uh, you can uh, common and uh, or else uh, do one thing. You can write this uh, 25 as 100 by 4. 100 by 4. So, these two zeros are common. These two zeros will be cancelled anyhow. And next, after that, 15 into 138. 15 into 138. 15 is nothing but, uh, first I will take 10 times, 1380. After that, uh, additionally 5 more times. That means, uh, Half of that particular value which is equal to 690. Now you can add these two. 0 and this is 17. And this is uh, one more 0 and this is 2. 2 0. Sorry. Uh, 17 and 9 10. And next 2 0 7 0. 2 0 7 0. Plus uh, here it is uh, 1 3 2 0. Now you can add these two. Now you can add these two and uh, these two zeros are cancelled. Uh, so after that uh, denominator is not there. You can add these two and multiply with uh, 4. This value is equal to what you will get here. This is uh, 0 and this is 9 and this is 3 again and this is 3 into 4. Now if you multiply these two here units place is 0. 4 9 sir, 36 and next uh, 3 is the carry here. And uh, 4, 3 is a 12, 12 plus 3, 15. And next 1 is a carry. And next 4, 3 is a 12, 12 plus 1, 13. 1, 3, 5, 6, 0. A new average of 25 members is uh, 1, 3, 5, 6, 0. But here he is not asking about what is new average. Uh, percentage increase in the average salary of all 25 employees. Uh, here, initial average of 25 employees 12,000. And the new average is 13,560. Therefore, percentage increment is equal to difference between those two. Here the difference is uh, 1,560 divided by original value 12,000 into 100. As we are calculating percentage, we need to keep 100. And two zeros, two zeros cancel and one zero, one zero cancel. 156 by 12, which is equal to 13 percentage Therefore, the percentage increment for all 25 employees salary which is equal to 13 percentage option A is the right answer for this question. In this way, you can solve these kind of problems. Uh, these are very important and uh, it will take some time to solve uh, in examination point of view. So, if you practice well, definitely you will get in within a short time. Option A is the right answer for this question. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching.